Calculations for square footage of the roofing surface can be made by simply adding up the areas of the various roof sections. The sum of the total area is then divided by the coverage of each bundle of shingles. Typically, an average three-tab bundle covers 32.3 or 33.3 .3 square feet, while our architectural shingle bundles vary between 25 and 34 square feet. It is advisable to add 10% to this area for material waste or loss. When using underlayment, the square measure of the roof may be used again to determine the number of rolls of underlayment required. We recommend our number 15 plain asphalt felt for this job. Drip edging requirements are determined by measuring the lengths of the eaves and rake edges. An open metal valley flashing is recommended for the protection of valley areas. Depending on the roof design and the shingle chosen, closed cut and woven valleys may also be acceptable. For ice dam protection along the eaves or anywhere that is susceptible to water penetration, you'll need Ico's Gold Shield Premium Ice and Water Protector, Armor Guard Ice and Water Protector, or Protecto Standard Ice and Water Protector. Asphalt plastic cement is used to seal at vents, stacks, or chimneys. Galvanized roofing nails are the best fastener to use for roofing and they should be long enough to penetrate through the shingles and into the deck approximately three quarters of an inch or through the deck if it is plywood. Nails no less than one quarter inch longer will be required for capping the hips and ridges.